Now on BBC World Earth Report. at sea are a serious hazard, poisoning bird and marine life and ruining beaches. For countries with extensive coastlines, it's a constant fear, not just the ecological damage, but the cost of clean-up operations. Chemical dispersants are commonly used for serious accidents at sea, and though they're efficient in breaking up the slick, they're less effective in cleaning oil from the water. This residual oil and the detergents mixed together sink to the seabed and contaminate the food chain. At Aspropagus State Oil Refinery near Athens, 150 tankers a day hover around the port waiting to fill up with crude oil. It's an accident waiting to happen. Professor George Nicolaides specialises in magnetic materials. He's come up with a novel idea that deals with catastrophic oil spills and leaves the water virtually oil free. I was uh, reading an article on uh, Exxon Valdez accident, what happened in 1989 in Alaska, talking about how expensive it was uh, to clean up the mess that Exxon Valdez created. The article was saying that how, uh, how come that after spending too much money, the cleanup job still is not done very well. It was an ecological catastrophe. So the idea came like, since I was working on magnetic materials, I thought that, oh, it's such a nice idea if the oil could be magnetic, so we pick it up, uh, thinking simply the way that we pick up the needles from the soil, when the needles, they fall on the floor, we use magnets to collect them. Professor Nicolaides and his team of fellow physicists from the Technological Education Institute in Piraeus have developed a material patented as CleanMag. It's currently undergoing field trials in the laboratory, and today, for the first time on a larger scale at sea. First oil is poured over the test area. This material is a plastic material where we have impregnated magnetic powder and it is in porous form, porous granules. So through capillary reaction, the oil goes inside these pores. So we pick up the material after we spread it over the oil spill. We pick it up and then we have also the oil, because the oil has, is, is gone inside the material. Clean Mag allows 100% oil recovery. Both the oil and magnetic material can be recycled. It's a non-toxic, environmentally sound solution. The three-year field trial, funded by the EC Life programme, the Greek government and private companies, is about to enter its next phase. A boat is being designed that can spray Clean Mag granules onto the oil spill and then hoover them up using a magnetic conveyor belt. This demonstrates the principle. In a real emergency, a specially equipped vessel would spray magnetic material 10 meters ahead of the bow. Then a magnetic conveyor belt on the front of the boat would suck up the material and transfer it to non-magnetic drums on board the vessel. With a large oil spill, Professor Nicolaides suggests using an aeroplane to spray clean mag over the affected area before the arrival of the cleanup boat. It's a great thing, because if you think ecologically, you cannot estimate the cost of destroying the environment. It's something huge. 